G'day, I'm Mark from Soul Sufficient Me, and here I am downstairs in my laundry, escaping from the family, <laughs> which are upstairs uh, making a banana cake. Today I'm going to dehydrate some strawberries. At the moment, we're in our strawberry producing time of the year, towards the end of winter, start of spring. We've been getting quite a lot of strawberries already in the garden and also commercially. In fact, the commercial season starts early here and goes all throughout winter. But it really pumps up at this time of year and goes into about halfway through spring and then it all dies down. So at the moment there's a glut of strawberries on the markets. And here's a punnet here that I purchased. They're beautiful strawberries. I purchased them for $1.50. So it's a fairly reasonable price. What I like to do, buy strawberries from the markets or even the supermarket that are on special and then dehydrate them so that we can add them to our cereals or have them as a snack later on or in school lunches because dehydrated strawberries are delicious, they're a concentrated, they're a bit like banana chips, they're a concentrated flavour of the actual fruit itself and they keep for ages in the cupboard and they're just really good to supplement other meals or to have as a snack, as I said. I like to just cut my strawberries in half. They take a little bit longer to dehydrate, but I find it's a better product if, or it's a better end product if I dehydrate them a little larger rather than cutting them into small slices. And it's just a bit more of a juicy bite to eat because they will dehydrate down quite significantly. I've got an Excalibur dehydrator, uh, it's quite expensive, you can also nowadays get, I mean I bought this about five years ago or so, you can also get cheaper Chinese type dehydrators, there's a review on our forum selfsufficientculture.com of the Chinese one that are one, of the, one of the guys had purchased and he seems to be thinking it's working as good as an expensive one like this is. but. Um, Regardless of what dehydrator you use, get into dehydrating, it's great. And of course, if you're in the right environment, the right climate, you can also dehydrate in the sun or in the open or use an air dehydration system. Or you could use your oven with the door ajar open and the temperature down. It'll normally take about 8 to 12 hours to dehydrate the fruit down to that it's quite pliable but not crispy and then there's the end of the, the dehydration phase done. 